Welcome to World in Two Minutes. These are your headlines. Displaced persons by conflict of 59.5 million. Marking World Refugee Day, the UN Refugee Agency reported that a record number 60 million people were displaced last year, with Syrian refugees marking up the majority of that number. There are almost 7.6 million people displaced internally in Syria and almost 4 million Syrian refugees outside the country, mainly living in Lebanon, Jordan and Turkey. Palestinians, Somalis and Afghans represent a large portion of the remaining refugees. Relative of the historical black Charleston Emanuel Church shooting victims gave emotional statements during Dylan Roof's initial court appearance. On June 17, 21-year-old Roof walked into a Bible session and killed nine church members. The Federal Justice Department has stated it is looking into the possibility of charging Roof for hate crime and for act of domestic terrorism. The next court hearing in the case is set for October 23rd. Brazil's semi-public multinational energy corporation Petrobras said oil spilled near Rio de Janeiro from a pipeline connecting a central Atlantic Ocean terminal with a refinery on June 19. The spill coincides with the arrest of Marcelo Odebrecht, the head of Latin America's largest engineering and construction company, Odebrecht SA. He was accused, along with his family-run conglomerate, of spearheading a $2.1 billion bribery scheme at Petrobras. The European Central Bank has agreed to increase its emergency support for Greece's banking sector. The new funding is believed to be worth up to $3.4 billion. The transaction due to pass on June 22nd comes after growing fear of a Grexit from the euro from failed talks between Greece and its international creditors last week. The funding is twice the amount of the $1.8 billion repayment the Greek government is due to make to international lenders by the June 30th deadline. Thanks for watching TRTWorld.com Istanbul.